We have some education coverage for you now. The schedule at the end of every school year is packed with fun events that students, most of them, probably look forward to. But with schools closed, Color 10's Nigel McDonald shares how SPS's PE teachers have created a way to keep one of their annual events going. Nigel, good morning. Well, good morning, Lauren. Phil Day can be an important tradition for an elementary student. The program helps teach students how to compete and how to be a part of a team. And although this year's Phil Day may look a bit different, Springfield School says it hopes all families will participate. Phil Day brings families and communities together each year. For one purpose, and that's to help the students enjoy that celebration at the end of the year. But with Springfield Public Schools closed, Brad Brummel says SBS's PE teachers have created a way to keep the tradition going. We can't control that our schools are closed right now, um, but as a group of physical educators, we can't control whether or not we offer this field day experience for our students. Brummel says the virtual field day activities are designed to be done at home using common household items like milk jugs and plastic cups. Our goal is to not overwhelm families. Our goal is to not stress, to add additional stress to families. He says physical activity is vital to a child's overall well-being. Now that we're in this new normal of being at home all the time, um, that importance doesn't go away. Um, and, and, and in some cases, it's probably even more important just because we're stuck inside. Casey Cardwell and her daughter Madison say they've enjoyed being able to get outside. When they found out that we were having the field week, you know, they they perked up. You know, they realized that we could get outside and there was actually something to do. Cardwell says the activities have given Madison a positive way to express her emotions. You put a hole in it and then you put water in it and then you have to run back, put water in it and come back. Oh, yeah. And then you can also put it over your head. That way you can get wet. It's like water games. So if anyone wants to try that, try it. <laughs> <laughs> well, National Phil Day is tomorrow, May 8th, and you can visit our website, OzarksFirst.com, for a link to all of the activities.